Hey, good morning or evening. We're not sure where it is. We're here in Malaysia. Megan and I are uh, learning some things. We want to share with you about uh, expectations and disappointment. So I'm going to let Megan kind of tell you what she is learning, and I'll share what I'm learning about um, our time here so far. Well, getting all the way across the world to Malaysia, I had some certain expectations and um, just expected to experience um, instant relationships, which is not realistic, and um, wanted to experience um, deep discussions um, about the power of the Holy Spirit, and we haven't gotten there yet. And it's just day two, but I think what I'm learning is in disappointment of that, because I have all these expectations because we've traveled so far, that um, in those disappointments I need to still stay open to what the Lord's going to teach me in, um, in all this. And He is, and I'm um, being blessed moment by every moment here, so it's been good. I'm learning. <laughs> and the disappointing part is that the, our CRM family is like a big family and we're kind of the new kids on the block so it's very difficult when there's so much already relationship happening around us and so dealing with that kind of dis disappointment uh, is a tension uh, though it's a good one because we're getting introduced and the other tension is that you know it, for all of us we, we all bring certain expectations to the table um, whether it's with a Sunday morning service or a mission project or with what we're going to expect from our spouse on the way home from from work or from school what we expect of our kids and and expectations get disappointed period they do and so the the posture that we bring and we have kind of been learning through with some tension has been how do we stay open to what God is trying to teach us through that tension uh, and so it's really pushing into that tension with open arms and open eyes and open ears and open minds and open hearts to figure out okay God what are you really trying to teach us because then all of a sudden once we got to that point this morning here we have this great connection with the, with, the, with the people that maybe want to move to Dallas to be with us to do this new ministry so very, very cool, very great the way God is so gracious with us, and uh, we just wanted to share that with you. Love you guys, and we'll share more as it comes up. Bye. <laughs> Love you, bye.